Well, new and noon, we start with an update here. Hampton police have identified the man that was shot over and killed overnight. Officers found 24 year old Solomon Roan dead on Bay Haven Drive near Big Bethel Road just before midnight. And that's where we find Casey Baylor this afternoon. Casey, what did neighbors tell you that they heard last night? Ashley Bethany, some neighbors say they didn't hear anything last night, but one man did tell me he heard several gunshots and the sound of a car driving off. Now flashing police lights created a scene these neighbors say is un abnormal on this block. It's just a shame, really. Overnight gunshots blocked off a section of Bayhaven Drive in Hampton. It was cars parked in the street there, then we heard the shots. We heard, we heard the shots then, you see cars taking off. Officers raced to the scene after the call came in minutes before midnight. They found 24-year-old Solomon Roan from Chesterfield shot and pronounced him dead at the scene. It would probably be about seven, maybe eight police cars out here. Investigators believe Roan met up with unidentified people. They shot him and drove off before officers showed up. I never knew hear anything like that before here. Neighbors call this a peaceful street where everyone knows each other. You know, it's most of all the people live out here, most of seniors, so, you know, we have no problems. They believe this type of violence stems from people who don't live in this neighborhood. People have a tendency to come here because it is quiet, it's dark, and they want to do what they want to do and then they want to leave. It puts a lot of the elderly folks over here in danger. They're frustrated, but unsurprised a shooting took place feet away from their doors. And they're worried this could happen again and harm those who live here. All of the violent situations is, is spilling over everywhere. Um, it's like there's no neighborhood now that's safe. And these, ne these neighbors say they have home surveillance videos, but after reviewing that video, they couldn't uh, make out any description of that car they say drove off. We're live in Hampton. I'm Casey Baylor for 13 News Now. All right, thank you, Casey. Now we head to this. Police are still searching for the suspects in this case we're about to talk about here. Hampton police need your help with this investigation that Casey just spoke about, though. If you have any information, you're asked to call the crime line. That's one triple eight lock you up. You can also message them on the P3 tips app.